Um, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do a ripple effect. I've used it in one of my CS videos. It pretty much, when you shoot somebody, it looks like a ripple comes from the person and goes out of the screen. So first open up Vegas and find a clip you want. I'm just going to use this jumping 180 headshot. Alright. So now what you want to do is go to the clip as soon as he gets shot and then insert a new video layer and download the ripple effect which is in the sidebar and place it there. So now as soon as he gets hit the ripple appears. Alright now what you want to do is I'm just going to add a bit of velocity to this just gonna slow it down otherwise you won't have enough time to see the actual ripple okay that looks good now let's drag that in a bit cause you don't want it to go too slow it could look a bit stupid but um... go to your pen and crop and go right to the end and make sure drag it out of the screen. There we go. So that you can't see any of it in any of the corners. Now go back to the start and make it really small. As small as you can. So now, as soon as you get shot, that happens. But that's a bit too slow, so just drag that in a bit. just keep playing around until you're happy. I'm probably just going to keep it with that. Now what you want to do is go to your compositing mode and go to custom and add your Sony height map. Now what you want, you can see it's slightly distorted there but just change the smoothness and you can see it you can, you can really see it if you make it less smooth. So you can just change it to how you want it and then um, just play around with the settings and you will see something you like. I'm just going to keep it with that. And that is pretty much it. Um, yeah. So I'm just going to do a render test and show you that. So if you like this tutorial, check out my channel for more and subscribe. And yeah. If you have any tutorials that you would like, just either comment on the page or send me a message and I will try and do it. Yep, thanks for watching.